I'm coming here to surprise Vietnam and the boat is just arriving. <laughs> I think he's gonna be... He's not gonna know what to do. <laughs> Really tough leg and it's a tough way to finish but um, Ben Ainsley said you have to be better to be lucky than good we were good this leg but we weren't lucky and some of the others were good and lucky <laughs> It was very different to the, the one from Cape Town to Melbourne in the Southern Ocean. Uh, the Cape Town Melbourne leg was more of a physical leg. It was it was windy, it was cold, uh, it was quite tough conditions on the on board. Um, whereas this leg was a lot a lot harder in, in a different way. It was a lot more mentally challenging. Um, we had three or four days, I think, of, of drifting around in, in almost no wind, uh, covering less than kind of 30, 40 miles a day, uh, which was really really frustrating. While we weren't moving, we were sitting there with Matt Frey, the overall race leaders, and Brunel also not moving. So that made uh, it did make it a little bit easier. We were playing the game, um, what could be worse, and you had to list, you know, three situations that could be worse. So uh, that made everyone uh, a little bit sort of, you know, you kind of have to see a bit of the light-hearted side of it, and you know, you know, you still have three thousand miles to go to Hong Kong that you can't just give up now. It was the, my first time uh, offshore for so many days. It was the longest time I've been offshore ever. And uh, I think I deal pretty well with it. I mean, 20 days go pretty quick, even if we were floating for, for so long. And those periods were a little bit frustrating and even more when we lost the lead. Because uh, we, we always had that pos positivity on board and OK, we're keeping up, we're keeping up. And then just two clouds show up and ruin all the work that we have done so it was I'd say I had like eight hours a little bit down and then managed to okay this is this is selling right so we can't win all the time and then we fight, fight back so it, was, it, was, it was nice you gotta keep pushing because yeah, you kick yourself at the finish line you're only a couple of miles behind so uh, yeah you just have to keep thinking there's, there's always there's always opportunities so you come on deck and you go okay i'm really disappointed at that i was in a dark place but we've got to be positive let's do the best we can now and everyone on their own little way has kind of come around to do that so i don't know whether that's led by example or whether i've just picked those types of people it was tough but everyone keeps on pushing and we've got a really good group of people and when someone's having a down day you know another person will kind of try and pick them up and you look out for each other and that makes a big difference.